The war council is not for a while yet. I should find a way to fill the time. The weather is warm and lovely today. Perhaps I should simply relax and enjoy it. <sighs> I must have dozed off. Hmm? What is this roasted meat doing here? Did someone forget to eat? Unplanned naps seem to have become a habit of mine. Hmm. Roasted meat sitting out upon the ground again. Mysterious. Surely the owner would have noticed two missing meals. <sighs> okay. She's fast asleep. Secret snack, activate! Stop right there. Eek! Princess of Solm. You are the one who has been leaving roasted meat in my presence. What? <laughs> no. Then explain what you have there. It's a fashion accessory. Anyway, sorry to bother you, bye! Hold a moment, I only wanted to ask... No use. She is gone. How perplexing. Sizzle and crackle on the heat. Nothing tastes better than roasted meat, yeah! You are not easy to find, little princess. Uh, lady, no! I wish to discuss the food you have been leaving in front of me. Guess there's no point hiding it. Yeah, that was me. Lately, you just look so tired. Whenever I walk past you, there you are, sleeping on the ground. I figured a good strong meal would put some pet back in your step. Forgive me. It seems that my recent outdoor naps have caused you to worry. The concern is appreciated, but I still do not understand what role the meat is meant to play. Food gives you energy, right? So, more food, more energy. Perhaps that is true for your kind. But such things fail to put a pep in my step, as you say. So, if that is your intention, I would recommend an alternative approach. Whoa! I didn't even think of trying something else. Got any ideas? Hit me! I rather enjoyed the song you were singing earlier. Perhaps you could continue that. Ooh, sure! Which one? Facing snack words? Meat on the wind? Bacon in my heart? I did not realize there were so many. I am uncertain of the title. The choice is yours. I can't believe you actually want to hear me sing! My time has finally come! <laughs> you know, I can't decide. Why don't I just sing them all for you? I would appreciate that. <laughs> Such melancholy is uncharacteristic of you, Princess Tamara. Oh, hey, Lady Nell. Perhaps you should consider roasting up some meat. After all, your step requires pep. You remembered! That's so sweet! The truth is, I'm feeling a little down about my singing lately. Explain. Some folks passed by while I was building a fire earlier. They said some stuff. What's that horrible sound? I think my ears are bleeding. That kind of thing. Inexcusable. Oh, that's not what bugged me. What bothered me was wondering if you also thought that stuff, but were too polite to say. Now I'm worried you're just putting up with my singing to be nice. <sighs> Sorry, I'm a big dummy. Indeed, you are a very large dummy. What? I cherish your singing with all my heart. Each song you sing is a special treasure that I will experience nowhere else. You must understand, we dragons live a very long time. Thousands of years. I know. Even the mind of a dragon is unable to retain the whole of such a lengthy interval of time. And so, many of our memories, beginning with the least noteworthy, fade away and are lost. That is why, to me, 
A memorable song is more valuable than any amount of singing skill. The recollection of your music will endure in my mind for hundreds, perhaps thousands of years. Wow! That's quite a compliment, Lady Nell. Thank you. Do you feel any better? Oh yeah, loads better. Being down in the dumps really isn't my style anyway. Now, I gotta sing my heart out every time I see you. That way you'll never forget me. <laughs> there is no need to concern yourself about that. The memory of you is etched forever on my mind. <laughs> Good. But that doesn't mean I'm gonna stop making up new songs. Oh, but I've got one for you now. I call it Riding the Flavor Wave. Ready to hear it? Naturally. <laughs>